Guys, veteran Nollywood actress Patience Ozoko, you know, popularly called Mama G, is leaving no stone unturned in this recent um, saga happening, okay? Now, of recent, we've been seeing Nollywood actors, you know, come out to beg for money. Now, this is not even a recent thing, but the shocking thing is that the, ca the caliber of actors we've been seeing of recent is actually leaving a lot of us, you know, speechless. Now, these are guys we have always believed have things going for them. You know, for them to not turn around to not start begging the public for money has left a lot of us shocked okay now we've seen um actors like Hamechi Monago come out to beg for money you know although in his case he said he revealed that he has actually been managing the sickness for seven good months before finally running out of cash and now turning to the public now we also now saw um popular Mr. Ibu who Okay, guys, he doesn't just make money from his acting. He has also uh, gotten money from amb ambassadorship um, deals. Now, he was paid over 15 million naira by Glow as an ambassador. And he also earned 8 million naira for another ambassadorship deal. Now, what we are wondering is where did all this money go? Now, Patience Ozoko has come out to reveal why most of these actors actually now come out to beg for money. Now, in this case, guys, we don't see... um female um, actors coming out to beg for money now, doesn't mean that they don't fall sick doesn't mean they don't have financial difficulties why just male actors now this lady has come out to give us three uh, good reasons and we can see sense from a lot of what she has revealed now um patience ozoko has revealed that um actors beg due to their kind of lifestyle so guys you know now we see these actors living large and most of us actually want to be like them you know they show us the flashy cars the flashy houses you know they show us vacations trips abroad and a lot of us actually envy them now she's coming out to reveal that it's not like these actors don't make money okay now a lot of them get paid millions especially a-list actors most of them earn um a million naira two million naira and sometimes even above per role and we know how it goes in um, nigeria where most of the actors shoot movies back to back so they're always having roles so they earn a million so what now happens to all this money now she is saying that um they now um want to like live the lifestyle with the public have actually like built for them so it's more like um we believe that they're living large they actually now try to like now um fulfill this desire for us so every money they spend now go into goes into and every money they make goes into buying flashy things just to maintain that so-called image that they have now another good reason she has put forward is the fact that nobody is willing to help actors and actresses. Guys, just think about it now. Think, just think, reason this matter. Now when you see somebody who you believe is living large, who you believe has money, this person is showing you flashy houses that they have built, is showing you the latest cars, showing you um, designer clothes, would you now want to give them out of the lead to their managing? No, obviously no. So we all want to be like them. No one believes that these actors need money, so we don't give them money now she's saying that a lot of actors actually need money it's not like they are um they're they're lacking but everybody needs money but when you see somebody you believe is doing well there is no there will be no um no motivation for you to give them money so most of them just live on that one uh, whatever one income and it is now what is actually now killing um, them now, there's also the fact that a lot of actors in Nigeria have just one source of income. Now, most actors earn money from their acting gigs, okay? They don't get ambassador ambassadorship um, deals. You know, only A-list actors, popular ones like um, Genevieve, Iniedo, um, Mercy Johnson, and the likes actually get some um, ambassadorship uh, deals. Most other actors hardly, you know, and we hardly even see male actors actually getting these deals. So, a lot of them just live on um, what they earn. Now, when you now factor in the fact that a lot of men actually have more responsibilities, you know, you will see that every money they are actually earning is now going into servicing one bill or the other. Now, we're not saying that women don't have responsibilities. We know a lot of um, actresses are actually shouldering their um, responsibilities. But, you know, in the um, general sense where we now see that men are the providers, you can see that these men will now... Um, need to take care of their families, you need to take care of extended families, and sometimes even give to the community. You can so you can see that when a person has just one source of income, you know, servicing so many bills, 
it will be so easy for them to run out of cash easily and even now and resort to uh, begging so these are the reasons put forward by mama g and we can see that they actually make a lot of sense now personally one advice i would give to nollywood actors is to actually diversi diversify their income now nobody can actually make a living or live comfortably from just one source of income no matter how much you are earning now there's also the fact that that income can just dry up tomorrow now if you fall sick like is the case with these actors now there is no way you can work you know when you are sick so every uh, money you have saved up will not go into taking care of yourself now like in the case of amechi monago now he revealed that he has been sick for like seven months and every money he has um and every money he has saved up went into taking care of himself now imagine if he had um, other sources of, of income you know passive income active income portfolio income you know just any kind of income you know as long as you have money coming in um consistently from each of these income if each of these streams now there is no way you will now get to that point where you are now having to beg the general public to um help you now um another advice to actors is to actually like uh, live below your means now nobody can actually be rich when you live even within your means because um you are trying to impress people and at the end of the day by the time you turn around to beg you know you have just broken that image you have struggled so uh, laboriously to build so live below your means try to save up you know for rainy days and whatever you save up just look into investing so these actors need to really sit up and take um, a proper look into their lives they should learn from the female um their female counterparts you know those that are actually not uh that are earning their money the genuine ways a lot of them are into other gigs as well that are helping them to live the kind of a comfortable life they're actually living now i'm not going to be mentioning names we know who they are we know how um hard they are working you know we know those that are actually earning not just from acting but also uh, from um, brand ambassadors ambassadorship you know no we, let's just hope that there's a revolution in the nollywood industry and that the male actors actually you know take a very closer look at their female counterparts counterparts and uh, learn it in or two from them so that's all we have today on the mobile entertainment please stay tuned for more entertaining and uh, gist okay now we'll keep you updated obviously as more um, info more gist keep on um, breaking forth in the nollywood industry as well as other industries now if you're yet to subscribe please do so by clicking that subscribe button smash the like button guys share this video with your friends and i'll see you in the next video bye guys